Hello and welcome to 2018 Fashion Awards with collaboration with Swarovski. We are live from London. I am Eva Herzegova and this is Royal Albert Hall who is playing host to tonight's most important fashion celebration. I'm going to be your host for the next hour and a half and meeting guests coming onto the red carpet. So let's see who those people will be. What? I'm good. Thank you. <laughs> and we want to welcome Caroline Rash, the Chief Executive of British Fashion Council. Thank you so much. How welcome are you? to the Fashion Awards. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for having me. We're delighted that you're here. Oh, I know. I'm very delighted. This is a huge night for British Fashion Council. How important are these awards for you? Well, it's an incredible night for the international fashion industry. Of course, we have British fashion right at the heart of it with our uh, British Designer of the Year, women's wear, men's wear, emerging talent. But we're celebrating talent from all around the world, uh, the best creativity and innovation in our industry, as well as the best new wave of creative talent that's coming through. And you're collaborating with Swarovski. And... We are. So Swarovski have been our partner on our fashion awards for many years, but particularly here at the Royal Albert Hall, for the past three years and um, it's just the perfect collaboration as you can see. Oh, it's amazing and I know that also the awards are really important for new talents and for your charity. They are. So not only are we celebrating the best talent in our industry, is that all of the money raised this evening goes back to our charities. It supports the next generation of talent coming through from scholarships to startup grants for businesses. So all of those designers you're going to see at London Fashion Week over the next few years, I'm sure most of them will have been supported because of events like this this evening. Oh, it's wonderful. It's really wonderful what you're doing. And how important is London to fashion industry? Well, London is such an incredible global fashion capital. Is you just have to see all of the fashion districts, from, of course, Bond Street and Mayfair to Shoreditch, Hoxton, Notting Hill, Sloan Street, Sloan Square, Knightsbridge. You have all of these incredible shopping villages. But we have some of the best retailers in the world. I would say possibly the best retailers in the world here in the UK. And many of them, of course, will be here with us this evening. Oh, can't wait. And what has been your fashion highlight of the year? My gosh, that is a lot to ask, is that there have been so many, is that our fashion industry is full of highlights. But personally, I think it might have been the Queen coming to London Fashion Week oh, in February. That was amazing, to Quinn's show. <laughs> to was, Richard Quinn's show, Richard absolutely. Quinn. He's such a talent, he's fantastic. He is, you'll see him it. later, he'll be here. I know, I can't <laughs> wait to see him. So I'll see you inside, I can't wait to see what you've prepared for us. I look forward to it. Good luck for the yeah. rest of the evening. Thank you so Thank much. You so much. Bye. Thank you, Caroline. Thank you. <laughs>
Okay, got it. Hi, and we've got Stephanie Fair. She's chair at the Fashion British Fashion Council. Hi. How has been your year so far? It's been a great year and uh, really exciting to close the year off with the, uh, with the Fashion Awards. I know, what an amazing night. You are hosting together with Caroline tonight. That's right, and Nadia Swarovski as well, yeah. and Swarovski who supports uh, the awards and has done for three years. So, yeah, incredible. Amazing. And Nadia, how, what have you done with Nadia together? Have you been preparing the awards? Have you done like special... Well, Swarovski um, leads on the Positive Change Award, which this year is going to Dame Vivienne Westwood, ah. uh, which is, if it, if it was ever deserved, um, Dame Vivienne Westwood should get it for championing change throughout her career. Yeah, she's very much about the climate change, isn't That's she? That's right. It's wonderful. Um, which award are you looking forward to personally? I'm excited. There's so many good nominees. Um, and, you know, we've got Nuta Prada, who's outstanding lifetime achievement, who uh, really has had a lifetime of, uh, of pushing the envelope on fashion and art. So really excited to have her here. And, uh, and then some great surprises as well. I know. It's really important for BFC to promote young talents as well. It is, and actually this is uh, an award ceremony, but first and foremost, it really is a fundraiser for the industry. Yeah. And, uh, and we want everyone to remember that what this is about tonight is the industry coming together to raise money for young talent and to give back. And it will really help them to support them and grow them. And, and, and That's uh, right, because an industry has hand. to give back to its pipeline of talent, and this goes to the it's charities, wonderful. hardship grants and scholarships and allowing designers to do their MAs. It's amazing. It is. Have you got some amazing presenters tonight? We do. We've got some performers, presenters. We've got um, uh, uh, Jack Whitehall, ah. uh, who always does a great job. Oh, he's amazing. He's, he's amazing. amazing. I have something he's to great. learn from him. Yeah, I can't no, wait till he pops in. No better person to warm things up yeah. a little bit. But uh, yeah, shortly this red carpet is going to be full of people. I and can't wait. Uh, you'll be busy tonight. And what are you wearing tonight? I'm, uh, I'm wearing McQueen. Oh, beautiful. Really stunning. Yeah, Have a no. beautiful night. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you so much. Eva. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>
And hello and welcome, Aquaria. Hi, how's um, it going? Amazing. You look unbelievable. Such you look an honor to be in your so presence. gorgeous. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. <laughs> Your dress is gorgeous. We are wearing the whole entire yarn basket. This is uh, Maddie Bovin, I know. fabulous brush designer. I know. So He's super fantastic. grateful. He's done amazing. I just wore something very similar on a shoot and I was like going to wear it tonight and then, and then I couldn't because I knew you will. Ah! <laughs> Goodness gracious. Well, I uh, appreciate you for letting me have my moment then. Oh, and uh, Maddie's nominated tonight. Yes, absolutely. How close are you to him? Um, not terribly close. Um, I have a, a couple of friends in London who are, you know, pretty good friends with him. But um, this is my first time getting to wear one of his pieces, and uh, I, I feel like the belle of the ball. So, is this your first fashion awards in London? First fashion awards, yes, ma'am. Wow. Okay. Welcome. Thank you so much. What are you excited to see tonight? Oh my goodness. Um, you know, I'm quite the look queen, so I love to see a fabulous look. Um, fashion is a huge passion of mine. Corny saying, but. Uh, definitely the looks are, are what I'm most excited to see. Okay, so no special awards you're looking forward to? Any I'm, performance? I mean, just all and any? Everything. Okay. Yeah, just super grateful to be here. Um, I think it's very unreal uh, for a drag queen to be accepted and welcomed in a space like this. So, uh, just anything, honestly. They could throw me in the janitor's closet and it's I'd be all about diversity. Happy. How do you, how much do you love London? Oh, absolutely. I love London so much. I'm here. Uh, very often, honestly, all throughout the year, and my fans here are super fabulous. The people here are wonderful. Um, I love me some fish and chips. So, how long are you staying? Uh, I have a flight out at six in the morning. Oh but, gosh! Uh, okay. Jet setter. Well, welcome to London. Well, thank you so much. Yes. Glad to be Amazing. here. Amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. See you later. Take care. Have a good ah, night. Thank you, my darling. <laughs> Bye. Thank you.
Hi, and welcome back. Um, I'm being joined by Karen Elson. Hi, Ava. Hello, Karen. <laughs> it's lovely to have you here. Thank you. Would you please tell me what are you wearing? I am wearing a beautiful Alexander McQueen head to toe earrings, dress, cape. It's I decided amazing. to bring the full Winter Wonderland <laughs> drama tonight. But obviously, Alexander McQueen, as you know, is a dear friend of mine. And yes. Sarah Burton now is a really good friend yes. and such an exceptionally talented designer. And I wanted to wear a British designer, it's obviously, really because, beautiful. you know, it's and the yeah, British Fashion Awards. I and agree. wear something that feels very sentimental. And you are English. I'm very Coming English. Coming back home. <laughs> yes. You don't yeah. live in London, though. You no, live in New York. I live York. in Nashville. Oh, Nashville, Nashville, Tennessee, of all things. And yeah. You are a wonderful singer. From time to time. Yes, time to time. <laughs> okay. So you are looking for any special awards tonight? Well, I'm presenting an award. Uh, award. I'm presenting for the um, Emerging Women's Wear Designer. But I'm really looking forward to um, the Model of the Year Award as well because it's such a special group of young ladies this year. And I really have a soft spot. It's funny. I've worked with a few of them. It's so funny now because I remember mm. being you know, the little 18 and 19 yeah. year olds and almost 40. And you and are <laughs> working for Models Alliance, which I'm I do so work for the Models of. Alliance as yeah. well. Yeah, which is an organization which is trying to get better labor laws essentially for for models and trying to introduce our respect program. Which so which model would you pick if you could pick oh, one model Oh, I can't do that. I can't do that. I can't do that. yes, you can. I cannot. I cannot. <laughs> okay. I really love them all, but I definitely have my you know, I love Adut and I love Kaya because they're both such sweet yeah. girls. Yes. They're really, really they are, good girls. Has there been a special highlight for you this year? Has there been a special highlight? Um, it's just been a really fun year. I think with all the changes that have been happening in fashion recently, um, it's just been more enjoyable to see the diversity finally in fashion, you know, with women of different sizes, different ethnic backgrounds. I feel like it's finally such an exciting time to be in fashion because the boundaries are being broken of what the norm is and I'm excited by that because it means creativity will be more expansive and yes. obviously I give my dear friend Edward Enumful a lot of credit for that as well because I feel like his um, him being at the helm of British Vogue yeah. has just open things up yes absolutely so yeah. i'm excited it's a good time to be in fashion it is thank you so much thank karen you, and, I'll and i'll see you, see you in there yes I will. bye sweetheart thank you thank you And hello again. I'm being joined by Cyril Gouch, who is the founder for Parler for the Ocean. And uh, please tell us a little bit more about that. Hey, thank you for having me. And it's an honor. Parler for the Ocean addresses what we call the material revolution. We can't afford anymore to use toxic substances like plastic. We are polluting our planet 
and we are running out of time. So we feel that it is the responsibility of the creators, especially the fashion industry, to take on the environmental challenge and to end the use of damaging substances, just to redesign the way we're doing things. Is your work being recognized here tonight by the British Fashion Council? I'm very grateful, yes. They give me an award tonight. I don't know why, really, because I didn't put a brand out. I didn't put a collection out. And probably I need another 12 years to prove that we are actually successful. That's amazing. So you're known for recycling waste in the ocean. We are known to make the cause of plastic pollution globally known, to create a super trend around it, and to actually make it sexy to stand up for the sea. Have and you to just fight. worked with Adidas? Did you make that out of the waste? Adidas was actually the first one to trust in us and, and to show that a big company can change. And they announced this year as part of our strategy to end the use of virgin plastic and to go completely recycling by 2024. So what would your message be to the whole fashion industry? My message is an invitation. I want the fashion industry to become the resistance and to lead the battle for products that actually protect our oceans instead of destroying them. Well, congratulations on your, on your well-deserved awards. Thank Absolutely. you so much. Thanks Enjoy for having your me. night. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. <laughs>
welcome Dina Asher Smith, British sprinter. How are you tonight? I'm good, thank you. How are you? Yeah, really good, thank you. <laughs> what are you wearing? I'm wearing the most incredible gown, obviously, by Delara Findicolu, which, yeah, I'm just feeling really fortunate to wear because she's such a cool designer. And is is yeah, she, she your friend? Oh, no, I'm going to say no. I wish she was. But no, I mean, like, I just feel privileged. You know when you get somebody really cool and they want to dress you? Yes, um, yes. I just feel really lucky. So. Oh, amazing. <laughs> okay, so just lucky girl. Yeah. <laughs> are you presenting tonight? I am. I'll be presenting the Urban Lux Award, which obviously I'm just super excited. So, yeah, see who wins that category. Didn't you walk on the runway before as well? Yeah. <laughs> um, a taste of a modeling yeah. a bit. Yeah, um, I walked in the off-white show, um, obviously at Paris Fashion Week, which was a world away from what I normally do, because obviously I'm, I'm a sprinter. So um, to kind of step into the fashion world in that way, it was definitely really, really fun. It was really interesting. How important is fashion to you? Um, well, I think it is really important, because for me, it's a way of self-expression, because when I'm running, I'm just always thinking about how to win and what I can do to make my body kind of work the best in the race. Race, but yeah. um, when you kind of just get to express yourself through your clothes, um, it's a completely different world for me. Okay. Well, it was lovely meeting you. Lovely Thank you so much. You. Enjoy your evening. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs>
Great I have been joined by Derek Blasberg and Edie Campbell. How are you feeling tonight? You're looking amazing. <laughs> I feel great. Are you, are you warm? Are you warm enough I'm out warm. here? How long have they you had you what? out here? I heard you've done my job. I did not last, last year, year and it was freezing. With Miss Piggy. But I had on a coat. How did it go? It's easier to be a boy and throw on a jacket. You, you <laughs> girls in your cocktail dresses. I have a fur coat hiding I mean, look at behind. Edie over here. <laughs> she looks she forgot her shirt. She looks like she's <laughs> boiling. I feel like I've forgotten something. <laughs> <laughs> no, she looks amazing. What are you wearing, please? I am wearing a brand called 16 Arlington. Ooh. A young British designer. Is How there a nice reason? I know the philanthropist. The what a why lot. did you Why did you pick him? What's the story behind you wearing that? Um, I just like wearing suits with no shirt. I just like wearing suits <laughs> because I just think you know. And it's Edie, just a bit easier. You're presenting tonight as well, aren't you? I am. I'm presenting Accessories Designer of the Year Award. Okay. Yeah. And but she has bags of talent. So I've got bags under my eyes, <laughs> and I have been called the bag lady. We're workshopping the, the, the bags. Out the pull out of the bag. Pull out of the bag. bag. Oh, that's a good one. You should yeah. use that. Yeah. So how exciting yeah. is it for you guys to be here tonight? We're super excited, and we're going to take these microphones to go karaoke singing <laughs> after this. <laughs> that's all right. Yeah? yeah. Should we go here? Yeah. <laughs> you don't even have What's a pocket. What's your take on with fashion awards? <laughs> what? Yeah. Okay. All righty. Stay warm out here, Ava. Well, I will stay I'm warm. Thank you for joining that. me for a little that bit. a pleasure. Okay, a ple cool. Always a pleasure, never a chore. Put that in the bag. We'll see you in there, guys. There we go. <laughs> Nice meeting you. <laughs> and hello again. And here are I'm here with Sandra Choi, the designer for iconic Jimmy Shoe. Thank you shoes. for having me. I'm supposing you are wearing. No, a pair. really. No. <laughs> yes, I am wearing Jimmy Choo. They're beautiful. Thank you. They're very beautiful. Is this your first fashion awards? No, no. there have been many. Have I've you? been doing this for quite some time. Okay. But it's been amazing and incredible, and we're doing more and more for the fashion industry, which is amazing for London so and for British. How many how many talents have you been dressing tonight? 
Wait, oh, issues. I don't think I yeah. can count. <laughs> Too many. Almost everyone. I'm not complaining. Okay. So what comes first for you, shoes or the dress? Tonight it was the shoes. Yes. Just because it's such an important evening for us, yes, the brand, as well as our industry. So definitely. It's fun. It is such a big night for brands, and I totally understand. You look amazing. You look Thank stunning. you. So do you. Thank you so much. I've got high heel shoes on, and I'm still feeling like a midget. <laughs> okay, I'll anyway. come down a little bit. Are there any special awards you're looking forward to see tonight? I think I am interested in the future. Any awards that has to do with the future, that is something that I'm looking forward to, hearing the names and understanding what they do. And, um, and that's what keep us alive and keep the fashion industry going. Okay. And what is your fashion highlight for the past year? Past year, 2018, what did we do? Um, probably because it's um, something I've done as a surprise. Um, I got to go together with Virgil Abloh to... Um, Congratulations. Got together to do a collection for him with Off-White. And that is quite a little surprise for Jimmy Choo. That's amazing. Like, collaborated with. He's amazing. He's, he's a, wonderful. He's very fun. He's, he's yeah. very talented. And he's a DJ. He, he's everything. He's listening to a lot of music. <laughs> and he doesn't exactly. sleep. He doesn't How was sleep. it working with him? It was easy in some way because we were working through WhatsApp. So there's lots of conversation going on and I can check when he's awake and up and trying to wait for his reply on certain yeah. things. It was fun. Okay. It's great. Well, he's nominated tonight on for a few I'll awards. I'll be rooting for him. Yeah, so am I. And the rest. <laughs> okay. You look Love fabulous. You. Thank you. Have a wonderful night. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you for having much. me. Thank you.
Okay, and we are joined by Mr. Valentino. How are you feeling tonight? I'm feeling well. I just came back from New York two days ago, and I am in London, the city that I love the most. And how long are you staying? Are you spending your Christmas here? I, you come to my house. I have a home here, oh, so you can come to visit me. I know. And what an amazing home. What is so special for you about London? London, I love the, the way they live, the English. I love the traditions. I love uh, theatre that is very, very good. I love to visit museums. I love, really, everything. And how much do you think London is important to the fashion world? It's important, but she's very important, but she's totally apart. She, she's not involved with other fashion city, fashion world. It's totally another discussion, but very beautiful. Are you looking for a special award tonight? No, 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 no. I did give the award to somebody a few years ago. And are but you looking for any winners? Are you, are you cheering up no, for someone? No, I have enough. <laughs> <laughs> I mean the fashion awards. This is such a wonderful cause, what they're thank doing, you, you know? Thank you, yes. very much. Well, enjoy thank your you, evening. Thank, thank you. you so much. And say hello to Giancarlo, please. Hello to Giancarlo. Hello, Giancarlo. <laughs> Thank you. tonight with Martin Marcus who have been awarded with the Isabella Blow Award. How do you feel? How does it feel? Super excited and proud actually. Yeah. Feels good. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You've been together for how long now? 25 years. 25 years. Yeah, 25 long years. 25 years. <laughs> and we've been long working years. together exactly. for 25 exactly. years. Yeah. <laughs> okay, how amazing does it feel to be here tonight? It's really great actually. Do you come all you the know? time? No. 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 Only no. when we were no. awarded. Only when we get, <laughs> a, get sitting, an award. I think I'm sitting at your table, guys. I think we're going to have great. so much we fun Great. We are going to have a great time, <laughs> as usual. Okay, anything special you've been up to lately? They, well, uh, just after our book, I guess we've been, you know... Which book taking was our that? Time. We just booked, uh, published our first book with Tashin. With whom? Yeah. Tashin. Tashin. And uh, then... First book? What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, first book. No way. Yeah. No way. Yeah, we waited 25 years. <laughs> I don't believe it. I think you did one before, didn't no, you? No, no, no. Oh, that no. was my thinking. Maybe it was my book. So we chilled, <laughs> for, 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 chilled a little while. And now, you know, we're back. And, you know, working again and making pictures, causing trouble. Okay, so you're looking forward to having fun with all your friends? For sure. Yes, having some party. I have, I have few words to say to them. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's going to be fun. Can't wait to be there. Okay, I will see you later then. Thank you. <laughs> Bye, thank you. Thank you. Enjoy it.
And hello again, and here we are with Alexa Chung. How hello. are you feeling tonight? I'm good. I'm a bit chilly uh, from the kind of neck backwards, but other than that, Can I'm I good. Can I see, please? Yeah. Oh, my God. Is this one of your designs? Yeah, I made it. So oh, I'm excited to be wearing it tonight. How does it feel to be a designer coming to Fashion Awards? It's very different, actually, because I, I used to attend this and I've always enjoyed coming to this event, but there's a, an added pressure when you're responsible for making your own dress for the evening, because I used to be able to waltz in and be like, oh, I'd love to borrow this and this. I was very fortunate to do that. And now I'm like, oh, my God, what are we going to make? But That's now, terrifying. Now, yeah, now, but, you you know, it's your own. And, uh, and yeah. I heard that you have done a Christmas collection. Is this I part have. of that? You're very, yeah, this is collection. great research. Yeah, um, <laughs> we did a capsule. So we did a holiday collection for all your party needs. Is it red and sparkly? Exactly. I mean, we didn't reinvent short. the wheel. I think <laughs> give people what they want. It's red, short, sparkly, all the things oh, you can nice, nice. make out with people in. Where can... Okay, what's your tips for party dressing, please? My tips for party dressing, uh, depends how much you want to rage. I guess one tip would be uh, if you're looking for a really fun night to wear shoes that can get you through the dance floor mm. and the walk of shame the next day. Let's see your shoes tonight. Um, that, that's, I'm, very, I'm wearing a very sensible shoe for that, that very reason. Do you, are those yours as well? These are mine as well. Oh my God, you're making shoes as well. Yeah. And how about the bag? The bag is Edie Parker. Edie Parker, what yeah. about the earrings? The earrings are Mew Mew. They are not Swarovski. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sure they're using those Swarovski they are jewels Swarovski in them. Crystals. They must yeah. be. I feel like they are. It's been exciting catching up with you. Yeah, thank you yes. so much. Thank you have so much. Have a lovely evening. You have a lovely thank evening. You. Thank you. with Alec Weck, who is presenting the Fashion Awards tonight. Alec, how are you feeling tonight? I feel good. A Do bit you? nervous. Yes, I can I imagine. Feel, I feel really, I feel good. I'm co-hosting with Jack Whitehall. Amazing. And really he nice. is... You know, he, he, he's a funny guy. He knows how to do this. He's going to help you, I'm sure about that. Yeah. Have you done your rehearsal? Yes, we did a bit, but then we had to stop because everybody's walking in now oh. and I had to go and get into my bow dress. And who is this beautiful I am wearing Amelia. Oh, She's right. awesome. Yes, she is. Um, yeah, I was just so happy with all and this. Sharanthi. Why would you pick this, pick this dress? <laughs> I have always wanted to wear a bow at the back. <laughs> I love Sharashi Crystal. Are you, wearing, love... are you wearing this actually presenting <laughs> the awards? I am totally going to walk in there with this. You're going to yes. walk with this. Are you changing tonight? Yes. Into like... I'm going to be wearing different and numbers. Are all your designers British? No, no. some are not. Some but are not. some are. Okay. And that's what's so wonderful about tonight, yeah. is being able to support this young... Um, designers because England has such amazing talent yes but also the business aspect is very important so that they can sustain that creativity long term I am so yeah. proud of you I'm so proud of you for doing this this Thank is you know you. such a big responsibility and yeah. you're gonna do amazing it's beautiful are you exciting to meet someone tonight I am excited to see everyone I mean most of these people I've worked with did shows some of these students have gone to the same school that yeah. I went to because I went to secondary school here. I was discovered in a park here. So this is kind of like full circle. Oh. So I'm really excited that um, I get to be in a room with all these, whether they're my colleagues or the students. So um, should be quite fun. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So the uh, awards are important for diversity as well. Yes. And I think- Is it a subject that's closest to your heart? Yeah, especially if fashion should celebrate diversity. When you're talking about being able to have all all the different. Um, oh, here we everything go. Together we are. Oh, oh, interviews without me. By the pro. <laughs> and here he is. 
the man of the night. Oh, my God. Sharing is caring. Sharing is caring. Sharing is caring. Get him. Be okay, a I, I need him. I need him because you need to like help this me. This is, is brilliant. my first time I love doing it. something like that. So, really? Yeah. Well, give you're me doing a wonderful tips. job. Everyone's been saying down yeah. there. Down there, like, like, like all the way down there. They're fighting their way through that scrummage of press to get up here with the nice... You have done this before. I have seen you before up there. Yes. How, how, how are you going to do it tonight to make it special? It's, well, it's going to be special because I have this wonderful well, co-host nice. this I evening. Know. And they've also lowered the lights this year. <laughs> Normally it's very like brightly lit so you can literally see everyone's face. And this time it's a little bit darker so we won't be able to see anyone. So that's going to make it easier. <laughs> Does it make you be more comfortable? Yeah. What, what does that matter? Well, because you can imagine that you're just doing it in your bedroom. Oh, if you can't okay. see all the hundreds oh. of people there, then when you see them suddenly, if you see the whites of their eyes, that's when it's scary. I like just Straight being sure. Straight to the point. If we could just turn out all the lights and we could do it in the dark, that would be the easiest because then there would be literally nothing. Is there anyone about. you're looking forward to meeting or have you met everyone already? This is what, your third year? Yeah, uh, no, no, I think I've done it a few more years than that. Have but you? the third year here, third year at the Royal Albert third Hall, year at the since Royal they Albert Hall. really ramped it up. So um, beautiful. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's really. an amazing. It's such it's an amazing dark. venue. So anyone to do. you're looking forward to? Who am I excited? Well, I'm always excited to see David Beckham because I turn into a 13 year old <laughs> child, and I know that's probably not what you should say. I probably should have said someone in the fashion world. I Erdem. Love it. I just saw Erdem. He's really nice. <laughs> he's a great guy. But David is really sweet. He's Every sweet. time we see him, it's like my kids are all over him, and he's always so kind, taking mm. pictures with everyone. Yeah. And his smile as well. Yeah. It's really like sweet. opening a fridge door. It just lights up <laughs> the room, wherever you are, which could be a problematic tonight because, as I said, they've taken all the lights uh, out. So if David does smile, that could okay. be a problem. What are you wearing tonight? This is please? Dunhill. So chic. Dunhill. Oh, I love so it. Nice. How you say it. Thank you. Thank you. It's beautifully. And your shoes. And we're going to have one of those oh, bows on the back. <laughs> <laughs> we should both have you bows. In the front. I should have his bow in blue. <laughs> what? <laughs> You look, be you look beautiful yeah, together. Very I can't wait to see you I up there. Imagine Congratulations to and another co -host. I'll Shall see you later. Look Best of luck. Yeah, okay, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. <laughs>
I'm not presenting. Are you being nominated? I'm not nominated. Are I'm you here. just being a guest? Are you just I'm coming just to enjoy the, sh the fashion and the, the, the fashion awards and uh, seeing your friends? Absolutely. Here oh, to support amazing. my friends and, and just here to support the British Fashion Council. Oh, so thrilled that, to be here. It's a wonderful cause, actually, isn't it? Yeah, it's wonderful. It's yes, wonderful. because all this actually serves to raise money for new emerging talents. Exactly, and for the British Fashion Council yes. Education Trust. Yes. So it's, it's wonderful. It's wonderful. What is so special about British designers? Um, I think their the their sense of independence. I think I think that their 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 fierce ind independence. I think definitely. Yeah. And have you dressed anyone tonight? I've dressed my date, Alison, who's over there, and um, a few people. But yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Are you wearing? Who I'm wearing, are you I'm wearing? wearing old Lamba. Oh, are yeah, you? Yeah. You look gorgeous. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> you look very beautiful. Well, you both look fabulous. Thank Have a you. beautiful night. Thank you. You as well. Yes. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you. Thanks. Lovely to see you. Nice to see you. And we are joined by Rosie Huntington Whiteley. How are you tonight? I'm very well. How are you? And who are you wearing? I'm you look wearing fabulous. Shawanshi. Oh Thank wow, you. it's beautiful. Thank you. It's gorgeous. And I feel like a big, a big glamorous bird, bird of paradise. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big night for uh, British awards and for British fashion. Yeah. Is there anyone that you are cheering up for? I think for me, I'm definitely going to be clearing, um, cheering up for Claire tonight. Her weight gala. Oh yes, yeah. of course, you made your dress and what a fabulous dress. Thank You're looking amazing. Thank well, you. enjoy your evening. You too, thank you so much. Thank you. Thanks guys. Bye. Who am I giving this to? Thank you so much. Sadly, this is the end of the Red Carpet Fashion Awards and I have to go inside. Thank you very much. Don't forget to follow uh, the at uh, British Fashion Council and fashionawards.com. And thank you very much. <laughs>